Hey everyone. So we're going to be talking about magazines and pay attention to this because it's going to change your perspective today when you look at how you look at magazine newspaper articles, especially. So I have a cover of me right right here. This is the magazine. So you look at the price point. You want to pay attention to the price. So for example, you pick this up at CVS, at different retail stores, you know, um, Walgreens, whatever. And you know, there's a price. It says US $6.99, $7 for this magazine. Can you believe that? Um, and then we also want to pay attention to the year, like right here. Look. It says April, it was published April, 2022. The reason why magazines, they publish like a longer year, like for example, right now, we're, for example, like if it's March and then it's April, the reason why they want to publish a little bit longer so they could put it on the news, like stand, magazine stand for a longer time period, you know? So that's what it is. And you want to pay attention to the back cover. Like these back cover gives you an, I, like an idea of what is trending right now, like a TV, movie show. And this is um, trending right now, the Star Wars, you know, it's trendy. So it says Entertainment Weekly, and then um, the old, and it says Obi Wan Kenobi. So yeah. Also, we want to pay attention what kind of advertisements are in these news um, articles or magazine. You know. So what I see in this magazine, and I'll show you something. So we see these articles, right? Right here, look. Pay attention to these at the at the magazines. And most people don't know about magazines because, you know, when we're little kids, we explore magazines. We always flip pages. We don't read, read through it, so it's always good to pay attention to those trends and viral stuff. You know, and you also want to pay attention to where you get the information from. Pay attention to the publisher, the person's name, especially. Um, yeah, most people don't know about magazines until you know someone teach them how to like navigate the sources, you know, through it, you know. What I see in this advertisement, it's a snicker bar right here. So it tells you, is this gender male or female? Well, I think that's gender neutral because, the reason why I say it's gender neutral because boys and, boys and girls can eat sneakers. It's gender neutral because it doesn't describe a gender, you know, so yeah. Now this, explains a gender role right here. You see this? Now this is a woman, this is her gender. Pay attention to this. What we see is a dog, you know, and there's like, notice the color, pay attention to the color. Women advertise things using colors like red, orange, purple, pay attention to the colors too. It gives you an idea what kind of colors represents them as advertising a product, a hair product, you know, advertising stuff like that. You know, so yeah. Um, also, people can advertise medication or, or dietary supplements, you know. So the reason why they advertise it, that's like a marketing strategy, you know, that they do. They use influencer, bloggers, celebrities, and magazines, you know. And I feel like, you know, um, sometimes magazines change the game of like using like anorexic disorder, like female eating, you know, because they don't feel confident with their bodies, you know. The reason why I talk about magazine, we see like, it's being portrayed as like, how me, how females are being like treated. And there's like balance and poses to like how men like grabs a girl, a woman by her neck or grasps her breasts, you know, um, in, in like a sexual way, you know, that's like modeling poses right there, you know. So yeah, um, what else? Let's see. I'm flipping through the pages to show you guys something so you guys can learn about magazines. Um, you know. So yeah, pay attention to these little things in magazine. Also, you can see that magazine they post like cake stuff. You know, like descriptions. You know how to make cake. You know, and teach you how to like make food. Basically, you know. I think that magazine, there's different genres. There's like decorations in the home. There's like men fitness or women fitness magazine. There's like so many out there, you know? So yeah. Also pay attention to the letters of design too. Like tells you it's so bold and what kind of font they use for magazines too, you know, publishers. 
Um, so yeah. And then I'm gonna teach you guys the media kit. So I'm gonna share my screen to teach you guys something how, um, sorry, there's my um, YouTube view, you know? Yeah. Um, for example, if you wanna look for like a brand for, um, you know, Entertainment Weekly, you know? So we're gonna, I'm gonna share my screen right now. Yeah. So this explains the um, the Mia kit for Entertainment Weekly. So it tells you about the full page, how much people make. A uh, full page is 231,600 and the full page is 185,400. What we need to know is that this is like a marketing number statistics about magazines, you know. Um, there's total women, 6.2 million. Um, and you wanna pay attention to definitely the subscribers too. And then, this is focused based on the age that um, people look at the magazine. So if I were to zoom in and show you guys age 18 to 34, which is 30%, and then age 18 to 49 or 61%, and age 25 to 54 or 59% um, targeting, you know, looking at this um, magazine. So uh, you could always uh, research media kit, like any magazines, like brand, you know, just look at the titles, like, you know, for example, this, Days Entertainment Weekly right here. So yeah, there's MTV Magazine, different ones, you know, yeah. Um, and then this tells you, and what's cool about this, let me teach you guys something. Notice that there's also um, people that you can contact and email, you know, about the publisher. Look at this. It gives you all this resources information, the sales assistant, the phone numbers, and where they're, where they're located at, you know, 22 contacts, see? So you have the right, okay, let me teach you guys something. You guys have the right to say something to, um, if you think that what they're putting out their magazine, it's not good content, you have the right to say something, email them in a nice way. Say it in a good language. Say like, I don't think you should put this like female because it makes us look bad, it's like racist or like, you know, the publisher think that it's a good thing, you know, the pros and cons answer, so, you know, so yeah. I hope you guys learned something about magazines now. Um, I feel influenced as to talk about it. So it's important because I feel like at our young age, we didn't know how to navigate magazine newspaper back then. But when I took this class, it taught me so much. That's why I want to share this with you guys, how to navigate. And it's important to look at media so different, right? So yeah. There's also this um, contact to, you know, material extension. If you're like material, like based on magazine material, you know, um, so you say sponsor. I was right about font. See what kind of font they use right here. For color, black type is not allowed to create which black use 100% K and 6% C color, you know. So yeah, and there's a medium. Medium is the HHI 72,000, uh, you know, and the media age is 44. So yeah, I hope you guys learned something. Um, yeah, so, it's in, so this is how we kind of digest, like, investigate not only investigate the term kind of like that but we want to see like the marketing about like the brand of magazines and yeah i hope you guys learned something um so yeah i hope you guys like this video please like subscribe thank you